you see why I say Xion is the elegant, sorry, Xion, why Dongi is the elegance of Dreamcatcher? Because, like, they even give her, like, the more soft, subtle pieces of the, of the song, right? Hey guys, it's Sam here. Welcome back to the channel. It's Dreamcatcher Day, so we got more Dreamcatcher. Uh, we're doing the Wind Blows band version. They're in red and white fits with some black mixed in, so all three of the colors that I, uh, I'll say love and hate at the same time. Dami fits probably the best to me because she's kind of got like the like the half suit deal kind of going on. Like she's wearing like a a, a a dress shirt. She's got a tie, and it's like the vest was like like half cut off or whatever. Um, that being said, they all look stunning as usual. I'm excited to see what this song is with the band and how they kind of perform with it. So let's get on with it. 저희 드림캐쳐의 이츠 라이브가 궁금하시다면 Oh, is there captions? So I know what she's saying. Korean auto generated. Mm, only auto generated. So it is what it is. 구독, 좋아요, 알림 설정까지 부탁해요. It's live more than K-pop. Live vocals. There's some backing vocals, but they're definitely singing. They're hundred percent singing. Oh, I like that a lot right there when Xion comes up right here and they all do it. Bam! And it goes with that drum hit. Now, you see why I say Xion is the elegant, sorry, Xion, why Dongi is the elegance of Dreamcatcher? Because, like, they even give her, like, the more soft, subtle pieces of, of the song, right? And, like, even fits with the core that goes along with the part. Just, like, this beautiful wave. A straight vampire. Somebody breathing hard.
You can hear them breathing. You can hear them breathing. I guess it'd probably be better if I did this side since y'all can't really see my hand that side. <laughs> That was live vocals. There's an odd eye live version too. Oh, we're watching that right now. We we coming back. We're just gonna do both of these right now. Let's go. Live vocals though. Oh. Okay, so it's band version. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, here we go, here we go, here we go. Of course it's Sua. I needed a second guitar player, man. And he's playing a telly. Like, I love tellies, but... This has to be Xion's era, right? 
Because I feel like Xion has absolutely owned this era. And I feel like if you're not a Xion bias, she absolutely wrecked you in this era too. So I know she did me. Look at Shion, dude. Like, she just, this has to be her era, right? Has to be. <laughs> Why is she so weird? I mean, I, I love it, but. Why is she the way that she is? Again, I love it. All right, so that was Odd Eye and Wind Blows with a live band. <clears throat> Excuse me, it definitely took us a little bit longer to get to the Odd Eye part. Um, it had a little more of an intro to it, and that's okay. I definitely enjoyed both of these. Um, I like the band better for Wind Blows, even though it's the same band. Um, I felt like Odd Eye was just a little bit light on the guitar side. That's just my own personal take. Um, I, everything else was great, though. Um, and I mean, he was still playing the guitar. Like, he still nailed all the parts. I just felt like it just needed to be a little bit heavier, a little bit thicker. Just me personally. But uh, let me know if whose era y'all think this is as far as the Odd Eye era. Because um, I personally think it's Xion. Because I think, one, if you're not a Xion, and I said it, if you're not a Xion bias, she absolutely wrecked you. In the Odd Eye. I mean, they all, they're all gorgeous. But, like, Xion with the short blonde hair... And I know some of y'all were like, oh, we've seen the V-Lives or whatever. We, we already knew she looked like that. I don't watch V-Lives. I mean, I've got the app and I follow pretty much every group that I'm already listening to or whatever. But I never see them because they're always going live at like 3 or 4 o'clock in the morning. Usually when I'm going to bed um, or if I was a quote unquote normal person, I would already be asleep for that time anyways. But it is what it is at the end of the day. So like I'm and I also stay away from teasers. I don't watch teasers. I never have. Um, so, cause I like to just kind of take it in for what it is, but I think this is Xion's era. If you think it's someone else's, that's cool. Let me know what you think. Um, let me know what y'all thought about both of these performances and, um, a little bit of a longer video, but thanks for sticking around to the end. Cheers to you guys. We'll see y'all in the next one.